for a while it seemed Richard that uh, cryptocurrency seemed to be heading down a lot of the naysayers said well we told you so the bubbles bust yeah. we're seeing now Donald Trump especially from the past talk up uh, bitcoins and cryptocurrency how do you see that impacting cryptocurrencies as an asset class in the months to come? No, I think we have to put this again in context, which is that the point that I've been making is that uh, people are looking for alternatives to the US dollar mm -hmm. and they have not been able to find it in other currencies because whether it's the Chinese currency or the euro, they face even bigger problems than America does. So the default option for them have been two. One is gold and second has been uh, Bitcoin and crypto as alternative asset classes. So I think that's what's going on because because remember a lot of people also who were bullish on crypto said that, that this would replace gold. Instead, gold has done equally well this year or almost as well as crypto has done. So do you see over the past four years, especially with a supportive president, which yeah. I suppose would at some level impact policy as well in the United States and have a ripple effect globally. Do you see cryptocurrencies emerge as a more robust, more meaningful asset class? It already has. You know, I think uh, beyond where we are. Yeah, in terms of the fact that I think it's here to stay, uh -huh. which is that crypto is, a, is like here to stay. Sure, there's a lot of speculative fluff which has been built up on, on the price. But I think as an asset class, it's here to stay. And I think that it's, uh, it's uh, uh, along with gold, you know, these are long term trends, which is that their allocation to uh, within portfolios is bound to increase. Now, where crypto, I'd written a piece, in fact, earlier this year, saying two chairs for the crypto bulls that one, that crypto has lasted much longer than what the bears had said. Two, the price has done very well. The only negative about crypto and Bitcoin, I'll say so far, is that a lot of people thought that this could be used in transactions. Mm -hmm. That's not happening. That, you know, Do you see that change? Uh, no, I'm not seeing any sign of that. So it's become an asset class. But as a transaction uh, medium, crypto really hasn't uh, picked up. Uh, so I think that's been the one disappointment. But broadly, it's been there. So I think that these are alternatives to the dollar which are building quietly and slowly. But more as an asset class, as a transaction use, crypto has still not gained much currency.